There's been times where, you know, I've pursued, um, you know, maybe more selfishly what I thought might be, you know, the perfect girl. Um, but when I've put my trust and I've prayed and I've um, let God be the one to orchestrate um, my, my relationship and my future, that's where I found Alex. best friends uh, with Alex so if I can somehow talk to this American girl I might be able to ask her out on a date. And I quickly realized there was uh, there's a few other guys hot on her heels and I thought man I need to move fast I know the best way and I'm ashamed of this send an unsolicited Facebook message And I sent this message, one day goes by, nothing. Day two goes by, it's seen. No reply. And so I replied and said, oh, sorry, there's actually a guy kind of interested with me at my church. So I can't accept a date at the moment. Maybe a week and a half after first meeting, I think I then Facebook messaged him back and said, uh, can ask me again for a date if you'd like. <laughs> someone very similar to Alex but there'd also be some kind of selfish desires that wouldn't work well and now when I've seen Alex I've realized um, who God has prepared for me and who um, and, and, and who she is is just so perfect and beyond what I could have anticipated and beyond what I could have um, uh, I guess even even asked for Today, you two have begun making the best investments of your lives. And I know the value of investment. You're investing emotionally and spiritually into a lifetime relationship. We, we know that that will deepen and grow. And from it, you'll both profit together. Your investment is not a stagnant, once-off transaction just for today, the day you made your vows, but a daily choice to remember those vows, to live by them, to nurture and grow and encourage each other's talents, gifts, and the assets that you each have. So enjoy the journey and invest into every day.
Daniel James Collins, today is the day that we become husband and wife. It feels so surreal and I can honestly say I have found the one whom my soul loves. I will love you forever. I will pray for you daily when times are tough and when times are easy. I will uplift you daily in words and in actions. I will stand by you in the thick and thin. I will respect you as the leader in our relationship and the leader of our future family. Alex, you are a precious treasure to me. You are a great investment. You're the one I want to make memories with, to raise a family with, to grow old with. I desire no one else because no one else comes close to who you are. I pray God's grace and forgiveness will cover my imperfections, my inadequacies, so that I can bless you, respect you, and love you with the same purity and strength you so effortlessly give to me every day.